Capricorn, welcome to your November 2024 Tarot Podcast brought to you by me, Kathleen Robinson of Karma Queens and Five Tarot. Before we start, if you're currently looking for that special gift, then look no further. I offer gift vouchers that can be redeemed within 18 months for 45 minute telephone or Zoom tarot readings. Press the gift symbol when you are on the Tarot Podcast page to find out more. So Capricorn, you've been brought the Six of Swords reversed. And the message here is to be flexible with your thoughts and actions so that you can move forward. It's like there's something pulling you back when you have come from, rather than allowing you to move on to new territories. Perhaps you feel that it's been forced upon you and you were not included in the decision to move on. What is important is that you look at the benefits of the transition rather than focusing on the drawbacks. So even this transition is out of your control, you can at least look forward to something and get some sort of personal value out of it. In a relationship reading, it may indicate that you've not moved on from the past relationship and you're carrying a lot of baggage, so be careful about that. In general, the Six of Swords reverse shows that you may well make some new dis discoveries and decisions and you may have some important information that you wish to share. However, the way in which you communicate it is as least as important as, when you, as what you have to say. Think carefully about what you want to get across to somebody. At work, there's an energy under which simple mistakes can cause major problems. Be especially careful with important documents and correspondence. Make sure your work's backed up and carefully stored. And if you're looking for work, you may need to feel as though as if you're on your own. That's not such a bad thing. Allow yourself to look for work in places no one else might suggest or consider you may be lucky. In love, it can show that you're about to confront some necessary issues in order for your relationship to move forward. It doesn't have to involve fights or arguments. If you can communicate calmly and well, it's not a time to hold things in. Again, think before you start spouting things off. You could cause enormous damage if you're not thoughtful on how you speak your piece. Financially, it can indicate that you're feeling a bit at a loss. You may not feel that you've enough money to meet your needs and that you may not know where to begin in order to get these needs met. Don't be too proud to reach out and ask around. If you need to make more money, this is not a time to make risky investments. Watch where you put your trust at this time. That's all from me, Kathleen Robinson. Until the next time, take care.